Good day, everyone. Welcome back to the LCA AV podcast. I know we haven't been on here in a while. We've been uh, busy perusing YouTube, so <laughs> I'm sorry we haven't been able to make it on in a while. Uh, but today we have a, a great topic of did you know facts? Because there are facts in this world that we do not know. Yes, there like, are. Like there is the white-tailed deer population is a crazy amount. You guys would not believe that. It's 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 outrageous. We'll have to do another podcast on that. Uh, uh, just about white-tailed deer. Kid. Just about white-tailed deer. So today in the studio we got me myself. We got Sean and our other Sean. Just call me Marsh. We got we got Marsh and Sean. Welcome back to the show, boys. What's up? So we have a friend out there right now, and uh, this podcast is for him because we know he's listening. Okay. He's always listening. He's always listening. <laughs> All right. So did you guys know that avocados are not vegetables? Yeah, no, duh. I did not know that. Did you know it's that? It's got a seed, dude. Sean, did you know that? Yeah. It, How did everyone Casey, know this but me? Casey, it's got a seed. It's a fruit. <laughs> oh, that's right. <laughs> Yeah, I told it. Like a tomato. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have a, I have one right here. Did really? you know that the hashtag symbol is technically called an octothrope? Huh. I did not know that. Oh, I did not know this. A shrimp's heart is in its head? You didn't know that? Did you know that? Yeah. Did you know that, Sean? I didn't. See? I didn't know that either. Oh, yeah, and then here's another one. Did you know that a hundred folds in a chef hat represents 100 ways to cook an egg? Really? Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. So, today on uh, the podcast, we are going to discuss a certain of these topics. Like, what is that? You, who's, who's playing who's music? Who's doing that? <laughs> Guys, we're on, we're on live. Okay, sorry, ladies and gentlemen. We have Elena and Yuna are just playing music to disrupt our podcast back here. Please don't get us copyrighted. Shh. <laughs> hey, Yuna, it'd be very nice if you for once calmed yourself down and beat and went all right, quiet. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So, <laughs> can you please turn that off? If only there was a mute button for a human mouth. <laughs> okay, okay don't, don't just ignore it, fellas. So, so, that would save us both a headache and our ears bleeding from the high-pitched noise. Like, like I said, our topic today... 24 hours a day. Our topic today is weird facts, facts. but we're, we're going to break down each question one by one. Like, like, did you, you not, did, did you, you know this? this? Why are they playing Baby Baby, baby O? Oh. oh. This is not... Did, did you guys know this? this? Canada eats more macaroni and cheese than any other nation in the world. Yeah, I, I thought about that, but, uh, did you know that the longest... So, Marsh, why do you think they eat more macaroni and cheese? Because they like cheese. <clears throat> but why macaroni? I don't know. <laughs> what about you, Sean? I honestly don't know. I'm Canadian. Here's my speculation. Know. Is they are part French? And we're getting copyrighted because of you over there, you know. Why, Why are you playing, playing never to give you up? Oh, All right, focus, focus, focus. focus. Okay. Here's my, here's my theory, guys. They are part French. Yes. They're part French, so they want Macaroni to Macaroni is Italian, food. not it French. Is. Yes, it is. It's a kind of pasta. Oh. Okay. All right, all right, here we go. Oh. Did you guys know this? Snakes can help predict earthquakes. They can sense a coming earthquake from 75 miles away, up to five days before it happens. I knew that, I just don't know why. Do they have, like, really good hearing? Maybe, but but I have a random fact for right, you. Let's hear it. The longest wedding bell is, was longer than 63 football fields. You're joking. I'm not. You're so joking. I'm not. <laughs> oh my gosh. Item back. What is this? Right, listen to this. Listen. Tell them. If you okay. Uh, so the longest wedding veil was longer than sixty-three football fields. Why would you have one that long? That's what I'm about. Here's, Here's what I was at. so you Marsh. Thought Meghan Markle's wedding veil was long. Get this. There's a woman in Cyprus who set the Guinness World Record for the longest wedding veil. How long was it? You ask. Nearly twenty-three thousand feet. Which is the same length as about 63.5 football fields. So, we're going to go off that question right now. So, Marsh, why would you need one that long? No one knows. How many people would need to carry that? You'd have to have, like, 50 oh, people there, behind there you. There is no reason you'd need one like that. Exactly. They just did it because they want the record. 
Yeah, literally. That's that's most that's likely crazy. why. That's crazy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This this I fact isn't looked up. I just know this fact. Huh. Um, I'm gonna be the one soon. The longest strand of cheese is three thousand feet. No way. I'm not There's joking. There's no way. There's I'm no way. Exactly. <laughs> okay. So based on this, have any of you guys ever heard of the 1996 Pixels movie or the 2006 Cars movie? That's a shout out to our friend out there. Yeah. So this is for you, bud. Love him. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh oh, oh god, I gotta go. What is it? An animal's yawn is based on how large their brain is. The bigger the brain, the longer they will yawn. Gee, so no wonder humans yawn for a long time. I guess. Well, why do like? I guess cats just kind of go. Why are they playing Cupid? We're getting guys, sued seriously, for you. we're on a, we're on air. Can you guys tone that down? We're gonna get sued, Buck, because of you. I, I don't, don't want to get sued. I'm broke. <laughs> I'm broke. If too. we get sued, you're gonna have a whole new problem because I'm so, taking that phone and. I think it. that's why dogs they don't yawn that long. They just kind of. Actually, the only part of missing in a dog's brain is the part to make them talk. Really? Yeah. Well, they have tongues, don't they? They do have tongues, yeah, they but they tongues. can't talk. Okay, okay, so let's let's wow, go Wow, really? That. A dog can't talk? Why do you guys think oh, animals... Why do you think they... God not animals? have them talk? Think about it. Because I don't think we need to know that thought. <laughs> well, here's a good question. In the garden... Can. The garden of... Parrots? Yeah. Well, they can't. What about the garden of Eden? Do what you think... Yeah, Stop rickrolling us! I'm breaking that phone. Do you guys think it's possible that the animals could talk? If you put the that part of in their brain, then yeah. Well, no, I'm saying, but remember, Satan, he was a snake, remember? Yes. Well, he was in snake form? Was that? I don't know, he could talk. He just so looked like a snake. He looked like he a snake. He wasn't a snake. True, but does that mean that they could talk? No. Now, oh, so what would you do if animals could talk? Like Balaam in the Bible. He I used would run. I would run the opposite direction. <laughs> yeah, Balaam the donkey. Did you uh, did you hear that story of the Balaam the donkey? I did not, and I don't think anyone wants to hear it right now. No, no, no it's in the Bible, dude. Yeah, I know, but I don't think we should tell it because that will take up time. It will, but it's really cool because God just basically used a donkey to talk to this dude named Balaam. Check it out. It's in the Bible. I don't know what uh, uh, scripture, but book it's in. Yeah, I think it's like in the Old Testament. Hold on. It's in the Old Testament. Yeah, let's look that up. Hmm. So, everyone, I hope everyone had a fantastic Valentine's Day and a, a fantastic Super Bowl weekend. Okay, um, it's numbers 22, 22 to 35. Okay. So go check that one out. It's, uh, it's really good, apparently. It's cool. funny. Well, everyone, thank you so much for joining us today. We are going to leave you here, but... Wait, wait uh, we've got more facts. I know, but soon, we're coming up... Coming up, we're gonna come. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna copyright. Coming up soon, we will be um, talking about the Super Bowl. No, See you next time. No, no. See you next time, no. everyone. Thank you for listening. No.